She had just finished washing the dishes when the phone rang. She picked it up, expecting it to be her sister or her friend, but when she heard the voice on the other end, she felt a chill run down her spine. Hello, darling. It's me. I'm coming home. I love you. She recognised the voice instantly. It was her husband, John. The same John who had died in a car accident a year ago. The same John who had been buried in the cemetery across town. The same John who had left her a widow at 35. She wanted to scream, to hang up, to call the police. But something kept her on the line. A mix of fear and curiosity. How was this possible? Was it a prank? A hallucination? A miracle? She managed to stammer a reply. John, is that really you? How, how can this be? There was a pause. Then he spoke again. I don't have much time to explain, honey. But I'm alive. I survived the crash. They took me to a secret facility. They did things to me. Horrible things. They experimented on me. Injected me with strange substances. Altered my DNA. They wanted to create a super soldier. A weapon of war. But I resisted. I fought back. I killed some of them and escaped. And I'm coming home to you. I'll be there soon. Just wait for me at the door. She heard a click and then silence. The call was over. She stood there, holding the phone, not knowing what to do. She felt a surge of emotions. Shock, disbelief, anger, grief, hope, dread. She looked at the clock. It was 9.15pm. She wondered how long it would take him to get here. She wondered what he would look like. She wondered if he was still human. She decided to wait for him at the door. Let me know in the comments what you think of this video. If you enjoyed it, please consider giving it a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.